Yo guys, it is your boy from Landon under Jetman99 bringing you TLTPG Battle of the Week back to this channel. But this will be the last week that I did that that bah, this will be the last week that it is on this channel. I will be making a cut uh, there because next week I will uh, no actually no it's the second last video that it'll be on this channel. Next week 14 will be on this channel again, but it'll be the last video because the next few videos will be on TLTPG and I will be continuing them over there after Marty because I'm going on holiday for two weeks. I'm excited as, but yeah, I will be continuing them over on the TLTPG channel. So go, su so go subscribe to that, it'll be down in the description below. And I'm gonna Hopefully have a brand new layout and all that if I can organize one in time. So, <clears throat> should be fun. More exciting things to come. And in, and, and in replacing this, I will I will be having a brand new playthrough series on this channel. For you guys, pretty much. Okay, so this week we have week number 13. We have Squid versus Alejandro for LDL week. Two, I think it was. Oh, something on my nose. Sorry. Yeah, so LDL week two. Now, so hype battle. Alejandro beat me one nil. Pretty much come down to the last turn. Ramwood lost to Stephen, also his division rival. One nil. Come down to the last turn again. So, one one last turn one. Lost on the last turn, so should be exciting battle. Let's get into it. Squid has Mega Absol, Moltres, Primarina, Mew, Diancy, and Fer and Ferrothorn. While Alejandro has decided to choose Tornadus, Gastrodon, Nih Nihiligo, Latias, Klefki, and Mega Lopunny. Let's get into this battle and let's see how it all unfolded. Oh, my mouse is gone. Sorry. Did not mean that, guys. Oh, I'm st still salty about that battle. Still salty. But let's move past it and hopefully we can get a win in our week three match of LDL. Squid leaves with Absol and Alejandro leaves with his Tornadus, but decides to switch out first turn. Knowing, knowing, knowing that he may possibly have a fighting type move to take it out. Good switch by Squid. Down into Poseidon. He's Primarina. Klefki comes out, Bojangles. Switches out his Primarina because of the flash, possible flash cannon. Oh, wait, no. Shit over there. And he's predicting the Clucky to come in. Good prediction by Squid. Brings out the Gastrodon. Mega Absol Mega Evolves and is going for the knockoff. Oh no, for the substitute actually. Ooh. Good play by Squid. I'm thinking he was thinking for a Toxic maybe or something. Knockoff onto Mudbutt. Just about 40%. Yeah, turns out forty percent. Goes to the scold, takes damage, and fades it. So we know that the scold does over twenty five percent to the absol. Yeah, we have magic bounce up on the absol. So anything that tries to basically set up hazards on it, gonna get bounced back. Kestron goes for recover while. Squid switches into Frothorn for the power whip. Squid predicts that he's going to switch out, so he goes for the nice stealth rock. Switches out his Frothorn. A lot of switching ha happening here right now. Switches out into, into his Phoenix. Ooh, nice prep by. Nice. Ugh, I can't talk tonight, jeez. 
nice by Squid. Playing really well here. I'm pretty much reading Alejandro like a book. Alejandro switches out into his Latias. Oh, with his U10, that's going to hurt. It does about 50% there, and Monks is the special attacker. Wow. Okay. Mega Absol comes in, going for the knockoff, of course. Which would have taken out the Latias, but he switches out into his Mega Low Pony. Gets the knockoff, which is nice. He's going to switch out, knowing for the fake out to come out. Which will switch into his Mew, knowing that the Mew can take the fake out e easily, I'm guessing. And also leave any fighting attack that may possibly follow. Goes for the substitute. Oh, okay, that may have. That may have stuffed Alejandro over, but both of the guys here have a substitute mega. Mine reading players right here right now. Mega Low Pony's gonna go for the return. Mew's gonna. Whoa. Don't know if that Mega Low Pony is max happiness. Alejandro better better feed his Mega Lope anyway. I'm, I'm, I'm just going to say that. Close to Psycho, which would have taken out the low Pony. Does about 25% to the Klefki or Bojangles. Back comes out that Mega Absol. Just for the hazard, Magic Bounce fight. Magic Bounce bounces them back. Big Jungles gets the reflect up. Reaper goes for the knockoff. Not gonna do much, but he's gonna knock off it. Toxic orb. Ooh. Must have had a trick set right there, but decent, decent. Flash cannon will possibly kill next turn, so. Squid's going to switch out. Brings back in his Primarina. Goes for the Flash Cannon. And this is going to do a heap. But, oh, what? That did about 15% right then. Wow, okay. Squid has prepped really well here for Alejandro's old team. Surprised there has not been a Mon taken down so far. This has been a really good battle on both their parts. But Alejandro... Oh, down goes the Klefki to a skull. Wow, okay. Primarina is putting in the work here. But I'm going to say that Alejandro is playing one of the worst games I've ever seen him play. And Squid's playing one of the best I've seen him play. So, this may not come down to a last turn mat. Last turn battle. As they have both had in week one. Squid, mate, go easy on him, please. Alejandro's just, he's just pretty much giving you the win he pretty much. He's just giving you the win here pretty much. And HP Fire isn't going to take it out, but Alejandro, but Squid's going to get off the Thunder Wave onto Alejandro's Neh... 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 Okay. He's going to switch out here, knowing that the HP Fire will kill him, and he... May not possibly at speed. That UB01, I think it is, has speed on it, so don't know. Flash Cannon isn't going to do much to the pink slime. Oh, how you go? <sighs> Jeez, I need to stop recording these at nights, I swear, but at nights is the only time that I have peace and quiet, so. Alejandro's going to. Squid's going to go for the psychic, of course, onto Alejandro's mud butt. Doing a fair chunk. The psychic should kill it again, I'd say. No. Oh, okay. But gets a special defense drop. Goes for the recover. And is going to get over over 50% of its health back. Brings out the Latias. And a psychic here won't kill, I don't think. 
don't think it'll kill here. No. Nah. But one more would kill it, I reckon. I reckon one more would kill it. Goes for the surf. Isn't going to do much to the Mew at all. About 50, 50 hit points. Down goes the Lati Ass. So right now Squid is up 6, 4 and Alejandro has his Tornadus Incarnate, his Mudbutt, his, his UB01, it's all I'm calling it from now on, I can't say it, and his, and his Megalopony which will die to the spikes and does rock. Knock off, but hasn't knocked off an item so he must be running his Fire EMV here. And it was a crit, it's a crit shady as Squid would say. But Alejandro goes for the air slash, not killing it. Squid comes out with his Z Sunny Day. Okay. I believe I believe that raises its speed by one. If I believe. Yeah, flamethrowers flamethrowers gonna take it out in the sun. Squid's going for a late game sweep because Megalopony is going to come out and die to the rocks and stealth rock. And if he has Solar Beam, it can return an OKO onto the onto the UB01 and Mudbutt here. Squid mate, well played on your part. This was. It was a good battle to watch from your perspective, but from Alejandro's perspective, he can come. A, he can learn a lot from this. A lot from this. Okay. Stealth uh, rock. He went. He, he went for the flamethrower and did not kill. Why not go for the solar beam earlier, Squid? Okay. <sighs> Down goes the UB01. Thank God, don't have to say it anymore. Out comes the mud butt. Squid, but Squid could have thrown that away basically if, if UB01 had gone for a rocked up move, but don't think it would have mattered much to be honest. Goes for the solo. I'm going to take out the mud butt, and Squid is our winner of TLTPG's Battle of the Week number three. 13. GG, well played guys. Alejandro, mate. You can come a long way from this. Really bad. You can come a long way. You can come a long way and learn a lot from this. So, take it as a learning curve. And Squid, don't play like Please, when I battle you in week 4, don't play like this, please. I need a win, because right now I'm... Oh and two. I need a win, mate. Really bad. So, well played to both guys. Squid, getting in contact with Steven to get your prize. And week fourteen will be the last time that 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 Battle of the Week will be on my channel. So go subscribe to TLTPG's YouTube channel in the description down below. I know that Brennan is Brennan has started a Pokemon XD Gale of XD Gale of Darkness, I think think it is I think the playthrough is he started it on there so go check it out and have a good day guys and enjoy the rest of your lives this this has been your boy from the land down under Jetman 99 peace